Hello students, so in this video we are going to talk about cutoff for the bit set at what score, what stream, what campus you are going to get, this is the target. Before we move further, you can go forward and click this link here, right, this will be also given in the description of the video, so that you can enter your score and get the idea of the branch immediately. Now if I have to show you the presentation that at what particular campus what is the cutoff which is required so uh, so if we talk about the most prestigious campus that is the bits pilani campus you can now see very well on your own for pilani computer science which is the most demanded stuff you need to get a really high score of 378 right i i am showing you the last 10 years record so the, uh, in the way that you can have the most you know uh, informative uh, past year cutoffs analysis so we started doing it from 2009 so you can see the increase in the score for bits pilani uh, you will find a dip in each uh, particular course from 2017 to 2018 this dip was not because of any changes in the pattern of the examination it was just that the bits pilani or the bits as such increased their fee at the last moment due to which a lot of people backed out and that is why you found that there was a you know a certain uh, drop in the cutoff but if everything goes well uh, you can actually pinpoint with the i would rather say a more concrete answer would be to 017 uh, score for this year right there is there, there seems to be less discrepancy but yes if you see there is no big change as such because 282 to drop to 378 from 382 now the next big thing is in the pilani is the as you can see is the elect electrical and the electronics which is obviously the second highest uh, preferred branch so it starts from 355 but reduced to 340 last year so if it all goes in your favor that this year less people are interested to go to bits because of its high fee then 2018 stats are to be followed otherwise uh, 2017 stats are to be followed then there is a huge difference right and this is uh, by how we have arranged it uh, you can also understand the pattern of what is the preference people have at bits pilani campus that is why the cutoffs are arranged in the descending order right so these are basically if you notice the top four uh be courses that right? is uh, bachelor's in engineering the chemical and the civil you will be surprised to see there is a manufacturing also all these three are in fact below the uh five-year dual degree courses isn't it amazing so you can see that th these are all bsc uh these msc courses are these are five five-year courses right so for these five-year courses even they are doing better than your uh, you know core uh, branches of civil chemical and manufacturing right why these are preferred branches we can have a different discussion uh, here uh, which is not the target but i'll just give you a hint that because economics is a field which a lot of students take because this gives them edge when they want to get into finance profiles also right uh, when placement ki baat karte hai, finance profile also gets opened because of the economics mathematics that you guys have taken right Okay, coming to the next campus, that is the Bits Goa campus. Bits Goa, again, as usual, uh, the topmost preferred is, again, computer science. Uh, two, 350 was in 2017 and two, uh, 347. Again, you see that it started from 306. And now, you can see it has improved to 350 because the demand for bits have generally as overall improved right uh, bits goa campus introduced electronics and communication very late so then you can see that again but as soon as they introduced it became their second most preferred uh, branch at the campus and uh, i would rather stick to 320 if you want i have also made a median score so that you can analyze it better average say better with median you must have done in statistics so we have done a, a median score analysis for each of the particular courses that you will find in bits goa campus so these are the top three uh, programs for the bits goa campus you can go and uh, study them in detail in the pdf format the last campus in india for bits the bits hyderabad which started in 2009 and 8 so it's again as uh, expected computer science and you can see that it's almost at par with bits goa campus which uh, starts from 350 it is almost 340 right so this is a good thing to see here uh, com com electronics and communication and there are two uh, you know branches for electronics electronics separate ele electrical separate 
which is good by the way and uh, this is the thing so if anybody has a score of something greater than 310 i would rather say that means you are uh, set to go for bits hyderabad at least with a very good branch that is electrical and electronics that should be your target if you are targeting uh, to get a good branch in bits otherwise you can see the rest of the branches here again if you see civil and chemical as the pilani campus trend that it's the not so preferred branch in terms of be uh, again bsc economics takes preference with the fifth most preferred branch right so right uh, you, if you want we can have discussion on this and we can make a video on the same or we can have a live session if you are stuck in what branch to prefer but i assume there's still a paper there are still a lot of uh, students who have to write their exam let's just give the exam and then figure this out Okay, and uh, this is the score analysis which is given by BITSAT uh, or the BIT, BITS Pilani uh, Admission Committee, which says that uh, in 2018, the number of candidates who scored more than 400 marks were actually 280, which drastically reduced from 381. Now, understand again, as I have told you earlier, this drop was basically because of less number of students applying because of the fee hike, less number of students who applied it is nothing to do with more than uh, the difficulty of the paper honestly speaking right if you it was a difficulty then everything should have been in the same order everywhere you will find that there is a drop because overall people were not interested but i would still say that if you want to understand the ranking uh, how many people are above you or below you can take the average of these two or in fact i would stay stick with the 2017 data to understand the uh, rank better though the uh, bit set never gives you the rank but this will give you an idea that how many people would have been possibly above your score so that you get those particular rank all right guys so again we have analyzed this for the last eight years you can see this and you don't have to see it for 2011 you just need to stick to the last two columns that is 2018 2017 which will give you a better idea okay lastly for the link of the pdf uh, the link of the pdf is in the description of the video you can go and click uh, and find the pdf plus the tool also it will take you to the page where the pdf and the tool is also there all right best wishes all the best from our side if uh, students are still to write the exam we just hope that you can now get pumped up you have a target in mind what score you want to target just go and nail the target god bless you all